I want those that are strong in the faith right now. Strong in hope to lay hands on those. If there's you need hope in a situation with your kids, you need hope in a situation financially. Not that you don't believe God's going to do it in your mind. We all believe that. But sometimes we're not really fully walking in that hope. If we have doubts or worries, we're believing lies. Did you know that? If there's an area in our life that's not glistening with hope, we believe in a lie. I'm going to say that again. If there's an area where you're not glistening in hope, then there's a lie that you've held on to that the enemy's trying to put in your mind. So if there's an area where that is the case, I'm going to ask you to raise your hand if it's healing, if it's a situation that you prayed for over and over and over and over and over and over. The day is the day of salvation. Today is the day that he wants to break off those cords of unbelief, of doubt and shame, of weariness, of hopelessness. And the God of hope is going to arise in the situation that you're facing right now. Arise.